What impact does digital technology have on privacy and security? The impact of digital technology on privacy and security is multifaceted and complex. On the one hand, digital technology has made it easier for people to protect their personal information and privacy. For example, by securing online communications and transactions with encryption and other security measures. Digital technology, on the other hand, has introduced new threats to privacy and security. As an example, one data breaches. Because of advances in digital technology, vast amounts of personal and sensitive information can now be stored and transmitted online. This data is vulnerable to theft and misuse, and data breaches are becoming more common resulting in the loss of personal information such as names, addresses, and credit card information. 2. Online Tracking With the advancement of digital technology, companies and organizations can now track people's online activities, including the websites they visit and the information they seek. Concerns have been raised about privacy and the use of personal data for commercial and other purposes because of this. 3. Cyber Attacks with the advancement of digital technology, cybercriminals can now launch sophisticated and targeted attacks on individuals, organizations, and critical infrastructure, with the potential for widespread disruption and damage. A cyber attack is an unauthorized attempt to disrupt, damage, or gain access to a computer system, network, or device. Cyber attacks can take many different forms, such as malware. Software is specifically designed to harm a computer system or network. Malware comes in the form of viruses, worms, trojans, and ransomware. Phishing. This is an attempt to trick people into disclosing personal and sensitive information, such as passwords or credit card numbers, by sending fake emails or visiting websites that look legitimate. DOS attacks. These attacks are designed to make a website or network unavailable to users by overwhelming it with traffic or requests. Man-in-the-middle attacks. These are attacks in which the attacker intercepts and modifies communication between two parties, such as a user in a website, to steal sensitive information or disrupt communication. SQL injection attacks. Some forms of attacks that target databases and involve inserting malicious code into a database. Query to gain access to sensitive information or manipulate data stored in the database. Cyber attacks can have serious ramifications, such as the theft of sensitive information, the disruption of critical infrastructure, financial losses, and reputation and credibility damage. Individuals and organizations must take precautions against cyber attacks, such as using strong passwords, regularly updating software and systems and exercising caution when opening email attachments or clicking on links. Governments can help protect against cyber attacks by enacting and enforcing strong cybersecurity laws and regulations. Investing in cybersecurity research and development, and collaborating with the private sector to share information and best practices. 4. Government Surveillance Digital technology has enabled governments to monitor and track their citizens. Online activities, raising concerns about privacy and freedom of expression. Individuals and organizations must take some steps to protect their personal and sensitive information. Such as using strong passwords and encryption, being aware of phishing scams and other cyber attacks. And being cautious about the information they share online, to address these privacy and security risks. Governments can help protect privacy and security by enacting and enforcing strict privacy laws and regulations and investing in cybersecurity measures. Please click the like, share, and subscribe buttons. Thanks for watching.